Hey everybody, I'm Blitz. Welcome back to another episode of Totally Accurate Battle Simulator. So we got some really cool footage from the developers again today, and we're probably going to go into playing some of our own gameplay here in a little bit. So the first thing we're going to look at is this beautiful guy. Look at those blinking eyes. Totally new feature there. Blinking eyes on the Minotaur. So the Minotaur is half bull, half man. And this guy has a very unique trait. He can grab things. Look at that. He grabbed the shield, ripped it away, and is just pounding that guy on the ground. Just hitting him over and over again. There's he grabbed another shield. And just a, a left jab right to the chest, trying to rip his legs off. He's got his arms. Oh, man. <laughs> That's actually really cool. Oh, man. Did you see how hard he hits, too? And he stabs, getting the stab. But he doesn't see... He seems to take a lot of damage. And he can do a ton of it too. So this is a, a very interesting guy. Now I'm wondering if we're going to have like uh, a fantasy faction with like Medusa as the... Oh, wouldn't that be cool? Making stone statues if you looked at her. Uh, stuff like that could be really, really awesome. <laughs> I love it. Oh man, hit with their own shield. I wonder if this guy could pick up like a, a big battle axe that someone else used and use that on his own. Wow. Pretty strong looking unit. Almost looks like a maybe a boss unit of some sort. I think these are hoplites that it's against. Actually, there's some berry pickers on the ground too. But just a, a really, really strong guy. He's gonna keep looking around. Do you see the eyes? How they blink too? That is so cool. Oh, these guys are just Oh, he used the other dude as a weapon. He he flung the flung the body at uh, his buddies. Or at the the enemy buddies. <laughs> That's really neat. Oh, cool. So I'm wondering with this guy. Like, is he red team or blue team, and how will we know? Are we going to know that? Because he doesn't have, if he had a saddle on, like a red saddle or a blue saddle. He's obviously blue, or his horns blue. They kind of look blue, but how do we differentiate between the two? I don't know. That's something we'll have to look into in the future. Maybe it is blue horns, because they do kind of look blue. But I, I was wondering about the mammoths and the same thing. Look how good he does. He takes out a lot of guys, and it seems like he's really, really strong. Ooh, uppercut, whipped away the shield. Now, that's interesting, too. Are these guys dead when their shields are gone? No, I don't know that for sure. Because a lot of the times when, um, if, uh... They, they can't have their shields ripped away if they're still alive, right? I don't know if I've ever seen that, a guy that's running around with a shield without it, without being alive. See, that guy, his shield's gone and now he's getting punched. Oh, wow. Two jabs right to the face and he's done. That guy's flying out of the way. Man, that dude punches really, really, really hard. And he's tall. He's a huge unit, too. Really, really neat. Now, it makes me wonder. Now, if you guys have any other fantasy units you'd like to see, maybe a Cyclops or a Hydra, let me know down below in the comments. Go ahead and tell me which is your favorite fantasy guy. Could be a dragon would be nice. Look at that. Yeah, I love how he blinks his eyes. That's totally new, too. I think we saw it a little bit in the last video clip. Oh, he died. Those eyes are X'd out. Wow. Okay, so it does. he does take... Uh, he seems to take a, a good deal of damage, but he can die. Now, removing the shields is something that is new to me. We'll have to try that out in uh, some of our own. I think we can, because most of the times we do see, like, a, a gun on the ground or something. There's differently units that are, are dropped in, or accessories that are dropped. They don't really have a good grasp on the, the shield either, do they? That's how the backside of that one. Yeah, look at that. Just barely holding on to it. Very neat. Cool unit. So next up we have this. This is a clip that they shared on Twitter the other day. It is a, a group of mammoths that are just using their tusks as a big line. I really like this one. Can you imagine doing a group of mammoths against the chicken man man? It could be really, really fun. Or what, what would you like to see the mammoths against? I don't know. There's all sorts of things I'd like to see. How about a mammoth versus a mammoth? <laughs> I think that's a little bit of a bug. Uh, they did tweet that out the other day. Went actually kind of viral. Had like 20,000 retweets on it. Which is really neat. Uh, this is what happens when you fight two mammoths together. They just kind of run in, and I guess the one on the left dies. Let's check his eye here in the slow motion. <laughs> Your little trunk. Oh, it didn't. I couldn't tell. It went too fast. But he just flies off the map, goes total ragdoll. Yeah, he's still alive. You can see an eye. Yeah, he's still alive. <laughs> Evidently, this guy still has a little bit of work and a little bit of testing to do on him before he's fully implemented. So now we have uh, no joints versus... He, they wondered what would happen if they removed all of the joints from uh, from the units. So that's their like the elbows and their wrists and their ankles and knees. And they just kind of look like a, a Bioshock character or Bioware character. Now this is the opposite. What would happen if they had super, super duper jelly legs and they run around like completely jelly mode? That's what I look like when I wake up in the morning. It's definitely can barely stumble around trying to find my way to the bathroom. That's definitely what happens. <laughs> Look at the big group. That's hilarious. Bunch of wiggly, wiggly leg monsters. They seem to do pretty good, but uh, they don't have full control over themselves. And finally, this. 
I mean, it's a little bit glitchy and a little bit derpy, but this shows something off that I've been wanting to see for a long, long time. And this is what I was actually thinking that uh, totally accurate battle zombulator we're showing and that is that tabs will have a first person mode so this is actually Willem the developer being in first person mode against uh, the other guys so that's cool you know I find it interesting uh, when I when I open up tabs every time actually this is kind of weird that the logo it needs a black background on it anyway a lot of people keep saying that the game got updated play the new updates it's not updated this is the last thing that we did Back in back in December, look at it, look at it. Alpha Zero Three, all those numbers. So yeah, it's it's not. There's no new units or anything yet at this time. They're still working on it, and we'll we'll get it eventually. Uh, I'm not sure if they're going to. What was the key? Yeah, F F key. I'm not sure if they're going to give us another testing version like this, or they're just going to wait for the release, which is supposed to be like late summer or early fall, something like that, maybe. Anyway, I did want to do some stuff here. You guys haven't been giving me very many suggestions, so please, 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 if you want to see more tabs, you got to tell me what you want to see. That's the only way that we can play more tabs is if you guys tell me more, because frankly, I... I get out of ideas. I'm not. I'm not a brain scientist or anything. I don't. I don't know what to do a lot of times. But I did want to see. Like it's been a long time since we did a lot of catapults. And now one problem with a lot of catapults is that if you do a lot of them, sometimes they just kind of fall through the ground. <laughs> and I, I like that. Now one thing that I like about catapults is that you can f put them in areas and they'll be in there constantly. Like. They might sit here for an hour trying to hit one guy, and in this case, it didn't work. But sometimes you're just not smart at all. Like, totally not smart. <laughs> and they'll just cost it. Oh, great. That guy's actually going to die. Oh, maybe not. That box. These boxes, if they get hit by a unit, then they blow up. So, yeah, that... I mean, sometimes you can just sit here for hours. And I wanted to do that. I wanted to actually do an AFK live stream where I was just AFK one day, and I live streamed it for like six hours with two catapults going at each other for no no reason other than just to live stream for two hours or six hours with a bunch of afk things going so yeah if you got any ideas other than watching paint dry then uh, go ahead and let me know because it does get quite boring <laughs> to watch ballistas shoot a pillar in the middle <laughs> hey look they drilled a hole through it i wonder how many bullets can get stuck in or is it hitting the same exact spot hello oh number the first one went away Okay, there are two there, right? Right? Yeah. So there's only they can only have two on the map at the same time. But yeah, isn't that fun? Like uh, a whole bunch of ballistas in the same map. And by whole bunch, I meant like one. <laughs> now I want to see how many how many thingies can we get in the thingy? Oh, well that didn't work. <laughs> Whoopsies. Does this work better? It might. He's hiding. Oh, it might hit him. What? I think he blew himself up. Now will this work better? Will this work better? I don't know. Oh yeah, <laughs> I think they're gonna sit here for the rest of eternity until it gets hit. Maybe. Looks like that one's getting kind of close. Oh, 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 get a ball in there? Nope. <laughs> they're just gonna sit here forever. Three versus one. Who's gonna win? Uh oh, that guy just got hit by a box. <laughs> the box just hit him right on the brain. It fell in. It went down. But yeah, it's been like five minutes. Nothing has happened. So it's safe to say that this might actually be viable if we wanted to. Just go away for a while. I also forgot how much fun this was. <laughs> Having a bunch of bunch of cannons shoot the chicken man man. Oh, I wish they would aim for his chest though. Because it's a little bit annoying for them. Oh, he got him stuck on the tree. Ba-boom! Wait. <laughs> there it goes. He tipped over. Man, we need more cannons. That should do the trick. That should do the trick. Yeah! Get... Uh-oh! <laughs> no, oh, I forgot. I forgot about the other guy, too. Uh, who was it? Which one was it? The, uh, the ballista. Yes. Oh, some of those guys are blowing up. Uh, the ballista hits this guy right in the chest. Oh, that was a good shot! And then it turns into the, this just big jelly man. What, which button was it? F? Which was the slow down button? Oh, it's, it's the left trigger. <laughs> left clicky button. Ow! If, oh, no! You got exploded. And now hit. Yeah, they're oh, right in the knee. Right in the knee. I wish the knees could bend backwards. That'd be gross. Oh, are they gonna do it? Also, it needs a fast forward mode for a long battle. Uh, we got it. Here's the, we got a problem. Like, nobody's doing this. We have one cannon left. How is he surviving? Oh no, the chickens are killing the cannons. Ooh, that, <laughs> that would have hurt. Right square in the groin. Oh! <laughs> hey, it looks like me playing VR games with the googly eyes. And did you guys see, like, these googly eyes are totally different than the googly eyes of, uh, of the, 
that Minotaur? Oh, man, all of these cannons lost? Are you kidding me? Who's left? There's a few cannons left. Looks like that, these two. These two? One, there's a few driving yet. That one is. How, did, how come they all tipped over? That one just blew itself up. So the kamikaze chickens are starting to climb the fence. Looks like this might be the last of the Mohicans. Oh, actually, there's two cannons back there, and they're not Mohicans at all. Ooh, that chicken just got away. <laughs> Good thing we built a fence here. Like, because if we didn't have the fence, then the chickens wouldn't be too smart. Right? Oh, man, there's a lot of chickens. Now it's starting to really lag, too. Wow! Look at the big puddle of chickens on the fence. That's awesome. Now, which one is they supposed to kill? I think it's... might be both of them. Uh-oh. It just tipped over. Oh, it just blew up! Uh-oh. There, it went down. Must be that one left behind. Uh-oh. Oh! Jumped on its head. Now what's left? That's the victory. Eh. I, didn't, I thought that would be different. But I know this one is a lot more fun. This one is what makes me really happy inside. All of the ballista arrows. Bolts? I think they're called bolts of the ballista. Oh, there it goes! Yes! Go pin cushion mode. Oh, his legs. Look at his legs. And now the next one. Man, look at all those arrows in there. This next one should kill him. I think. Uh, I don't know. Maybe. I think they nerfed the... Uh, oh! Oh, that was pretty good. I think they nerfed the ballistas in this patch. The one before, they were super overpowered. Okay, ready? There it goes. There it goes. Oh, he's dead. Oh, he didn't go jelly mode. Aw. Started to. Just a little bit. Let's try him a little bit closer. Fire the missiles. Whee! <laughs> These guys got skewered. Oh, it just totally pooped out a dude right in front of us. Oh, that was gross. Hey, get ready. Get set. And fire the missiles. Oh, come on. Go jelly mode. Go jelly mode. Nope. Here comes another one. Here it comes. Why doesn't he go jelly mode? He died again without going jelly mode. Oh, it's too bad. So let's try this. We have about 100 samurais versus 100 regular chicken men. Oh. Let's see what, what happens. So these guys are going to poop out a lot of chickens. It'll get really leggy really quick. But we don't know. We don't know what'll happen. Wow. Look at, look at the big look at the big swarm of chickens coming up to the front lines. We'll have to see. I'm guessing that the chickens might actually win. Maybe not. Doesn't seem like they're... Right, look at that. Straight up. Not one isn't killing them. I thought maybe one would be enough. Ooh. He stabbed in the back. Look at the artwork on that sword. That's nice. Why are you, what are you doing to him? What are you doing to him? Monster. Okay, so it looks like the Samurai Masters are kind of uh, clearing the floor. These guys, Samurai Masters are one of the most powerful dudes in the game. Uh, besides, like, the M16. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, they, they definitely uh, took them out. Wow. Was not expecting that. That really makes me wonder if the Samurai Masters, 100 Samurai Masters, can kill the uh, M16s. Now, if I remember, yeah, they do have a lot of hit points. Oh, they've killed all their buddies. Now, that shouldn't be too big of a problem. Maybe. That back row is pretty strong. I wonder how many it would take. Wow. It's super laggy. Okay, they are going down in droves. Lots of them going cut up. Uh, this would be... I wish we could have the mammoths in here. Oh, there, there's the victory. wish we could have the mammoths in. Wouldn't that be fun? Run mammoths against the machine guns? Okay, I, I switched it out. I've only got 10 of the machine gunners in the M16 units. What Does it actually look like an M16? I don't remember. Yeah, I guess so. So can 10 guys take out 100 of the Samurai Masters? That is the question that I have today. That's It's like Mythbusters, Blitz style. Tabs, uh-oh. Oh, they can do it. Maybe not. We got four, oh, those two are stuck. Okay, oh, they, they're gonna do it easy. Easy peasy, easy peasy. Yep, 100 to one. Wow, <laughs> that was pretty good. I'm gonna take 25 chariots versus the the 10 M16 guys. I don't think the chariots are gonna live through this. Oh, they might. Oh, no. Oh, they can sneak around through the rocks. Oh, <laughs> they're flying. I guess they're dying and flying. Yeah, that's not gonna work either. Wow. Hey, we got one. Oh, they picked it up. Who's left? Who's left? Do we have a horse? <laughs> it's Santa Claus. How'd they shoot through the... What? <laughs> he went straight into the rock. Hey, bud. What's up? You want to watch Daniel Tiger, buddy? Yeah. You want to see something cool? Hey, come up here. Do you want to see the bear guys? And the chickens? Yeah. You want to see the bears and the chickens? Should we go on the grass level? Or do you like this level? Or would you like the snow level? Does that one look fun? No, no, it's that level. Which one? 
The grass. The grass one? Mm -hmm. Okay, now should we put some bear guys in here? Yeah. You like those guys? You see how they have bears on their heads? Those look neat, don't they? Yeah? Okay. So let's let's put some bear guys. Should we do how many bear guys? Can you count them? Can you count? What's this? Two. There's two of them? Mm. Now, can you go how many? This one, this one, this one, this one. Can you count them up? One, two, yeah. Two, Yeah, good job, buddy. That was that was close enough. That'll work. And we'll put in we'll put in we'll put in maybe ten. Let's go ten of them, okay? Can you count to ten really fast? One, two, three, Good job, buddy. Okay, let's go with those guys against some chicken dudes, okay? You want some? I want chickens. That's all the animals that we have in here. Okay, you ready? You ready to see the chickens? Here they go. Look at look at these guys. Look at their little chickens. Watch. <gasps> Do you see the chickens? Are they cool or what? I'm just gonna walk Oh, the chickens are the chickens are trying to eat the bear thing, guys. Oh no! What's happening? And the bear thing guys going down. Yeah, the bear guys are getting eaten by the chicken guys. Oh no! Oh no! All the bears got are gone. Maybe we have too many chickens. Did we have too many chickens? Do you think? Yeah. Yeah, let's just do a couple smaller chickens, and then we still have the bears. <gasps> you know what else we could do? Mm. We have horsies. Mm. You want to see the horsies? Mm. Yeah? Mm. Uh-oh, here comes the bear, guys. Look at the bears getting attacked by the chickens. Oh, no. Now watch. And smash, get smashed. Uh-oh. <laughs> yes, there we go. The bear guys are attacking the chicken man. Is that fun? You want to see the horsies? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go see. The oh, that guy just got picked up. Okay, let's go. Let's go see the horsies, buddy. Ready? Mm -hmm. Should we do bear guys against the horsey guys? Yeah, you're nodding your head. These aren't really horsies, but these are the deer. Do you see the deer? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Gotta speak up a little bit, buddy. Let's put in a couple bear guys here, okay? And grease and. Bear guys. How many bear guys should we put in? Five. Mm. Two five. Mm. Is that? Do we? Do you want more than that? Nope. Nope. Okay. Good call. I think you did. I think you did the right number here. Uh oh. <gasps> oh, he hit the horsey. Who's gonna win, buddy? Mm. Are the horsey or is the the deer stronger or the bear guys stronger? The deer. The deer are stronger. Mm. I don't know if you're right about that, but we'll see. We only have one deer left. There he is! Look at the deer! Uh-oh. He's coming around the rock. And there are four bear guys left. Go, deer, go! Yes! Uh-oh! Oh, no! The deer just fell apart. That's sad, isn't it? You want to watch Daniel Tiger now? No? <laughs> okay, buddy. Can you say thank you for watching? And keep your stick on the ice. Keep your stick on the ice. Good job, buddy.